you know, we live in such a distracting world. How can we connect and really be in the moment? On today's podcast, we'll be joined by comedian Elon Gold, influencer Lizzie Savetsky, singer God Elbaz, and life coach Gedalia Fenster, who will all share how they block out the noise, how they can truly be in the moment. Driving in every direction I am hit with distractions in this place Call my mind My mind is a prison Trapped in a wondrous mansion I'm lost in doubts With no Just recognize there's a part of you that stays, that stays here in this moment that isn't broken, that is beautiful, my soul, my soul, my soul, my soul. This is why when we say Friday night, we're saying, God, you took us out of slavery. What is slavery? Needing always a phone, needing this, needing this, not being able to be in the moment. It's very important to be in your head, to be focused. And whether I'm going on stage or I'm about to have a meeting with Larry David or have a meeting with God on Rosh Hashanah. And I'm not comparing God to Larry David, but they both do determine whether or not I'm gonna have a good year. The point is, you gotta stay focused, you gotta stay in the moment, and shut down everything from your phone to the people around you, and get into it, and get ready for it. And if you don't meditate, and if you don't have the focus, you're not gonna get what you want out of what you're about to do. Normally it's on stage, and I gotta prepare myself to uh, be a vessel, and to be like a pipe that transmit everything on my mind, everything in my soul, to the audience. And in order to do so, I say Shir Lamalot, 
Tehilim, and I ask from Hashem that everything that I will sing tonight won't go chas v'shalom for my pride, only to glorify Hashem. By doing so, you're already tapped in to the source, because the ruach, the spirit that comes out of you, the air is Hashem. So take a deep breath. Think about why you're here in this world and why you're doing what you're doing. It can be incredibly hard to stay present, especially in one of the most overstimulating cities in the world. And I don't know about you, but I have a real tendency towards anxiety and future tripping. So when I find myself doing that throughout my day, I have what I call the three P's to practice presence. I pause. So I unplug from my phone, I take a second away, I perceive, I take in whatever I'm actually feeling. My five senses, my eyes, my smell, what am I hearing? And I bring myself into the moment with my perception and then I pray. I ask Hashem to help me stay present and I talk to God all throughout the day because this is something that requires practice and it requires help and support from our higher power God.